Hello, this is the fifth problem from RMO 2018. It's quite an interesting problem in its own right. Uh, it says that we want to find all natural numbers 1 plus uh, floor of square root of 2n uh, should divide 2n. All such natural numbers says that this happens. So the key idea is uh, in all of these problems is basically something called representation representation so and this is a very simple idea uh, any natural number any natural number is always between a square as a square number and the next square so this is a very simple principle but what is often very useful uh, let's suppose uh, and this is true if you take any natural number it should be uh, between a square number some square number and the next square number it's kind of obvious uh, let's say if you take 10 that's between 9 and 16 so you can enclose any natural number in between a square number and another square number the next one uh, so suppose we take square root of 2n and the uh, or rather let's let's work with 2n 2n is a natural number so it will be between let's say a square and a plus 1 square so a square quantity and the next square quantity a square quantity and the next square quantity uh, so we can write 2n 2n as a square plus some constant quantity so this could be 0 so could be 0 if 2 if 2 n is a square itself otherwise there will be something okay so now if that happens so square root of 2 n floor of that will be just a and now we can compute 1 plus floor of this which is 1 plus a and we want that to divide we want that to divide 2n so we assume that 2n is a square plus some quantity so we want so we want 1 plus a to divide a square plus k so let's do a simple long division uh, because this by the way this was our assumption that that's the value of 2n so if I do do a long division so a square plus k if I let it divide by a plus 1 then if I put a here then we have a square plus a this will be k minus a so if if a plus 1 exactly divides a square plus k then the remainder k minus a is equal to 0 or a is equal to k so this quantity k must be equal to a okay so we are done almost because then we found that 2n is equals to a square plus a because this k we found to be a and this implies n is equal to a square plus a by 2 which implies that this is a into a plus 1 by 2 so all natural numbers all natural numbers which are of this form uh, they will uh, have this property and these are these numbers and this is a these are, these are very famous numbers these are called triangular numbers these are called let me write that triangular numbers 
and uh, triangular numbers will have this beautiful property and uh, example is if you plug in a is equal to 1 if you plug in a is equal to 1 you'll get n is equal to 1 a is equal to 2 uh, will give you n equals to 3 a equals to 3 will give you n equals to 6 and so on so these are the triangular numbers and these are the numbers so precisely the numbers which satisfies this property that that uh, 1 plus floor of square root of 2n will divide 2n